Statins are a class of drugs often prescribed by doctors to help lower cholesterol. Studies claiming that statins reduce risk of heart attack, stroke, and even death from heart disease by up to 35%. But you know what's odd? These studies disappeared in 2005 when they made it a requirement to make all statin trials public. But hey, let's just ignore that because we're making too much money on statins. The real cause of heart disease is omega-6 fatty acid, linoleic acid. When you consume large amounts of vegetable seed oils, they oxidize in your body, causing massive systemic inflammation in just about every cell. They get lodged in your arteries. But if you're consuming a natural diet, you won't have these inflammatory plant fats in your body in the first place. Now, what do statins actually do? They kill your cells. Simple as that. Their mode of action is primarily via inhibition of HMG-CoA reductase, that is hydroxymethylglutarol coenzyme A, the rate-limiting enzyme in the cholesterol biosynthesis pathway. If we take a look at this pathway, the statins are at the top, inhibiting acetyl coenzyme A, the goal being to reduce cholesterol, but Look at all of the other metabolic functions and processes in the body we are trying to stop. The amount to go over here and understand for the average person is astronomical. Acetyl coenzyme A is a molecule that participates in biochemical reactions in protein, carbohydrate, and lipid metabolism. Its main function being involved in energy production. Statins inhibit it being converted into cholesterol and coenzyme Q10, a vitamin present in all eukaryotic cells. Normally, acetyl coenzyme A would be reduced into mevalonate. The mevalonate pathway is not only necessary for cholesterol and coenzyme Q10 production, it makes thousands of different molecules, such as heme, vitamin K, all of the steroid hormones. After several more metabolic reactions requiring various enzymes and genes, we branch off into two of the most important things for our body, cholesterol and coenzyme Q10. Cholesterol comprises all of our cell membranes, so without it, we can't heal our bodies. It's also a key component for bile production, so by taking statins, you are impairing your body's digestive ability. It's needed as a precursor for all hormones, including vitamin D3. My grandma actually craves ice cream when they put her on a statin because her body is crying for energy. Coenzyme Q10 is important for mitochondrial respiration, the energy production inside every single cell. The mitochondria are the most important factor in healthy aging and wellness. Statins essentially poison your mitochondria, inhibiting your ability to produce energy, and can even kill cells off completely. This is why many people who take statins have muscle weakness and are unable to exercise. A good analogy for taking statins is that they are like reducing the speed of your car from 100 miles per hour to 80 miles per hour because you are driving towards a brick wall. Yes, it might increase your likelihood of surviving the accident, but you are not looking at the right solution. Stop driving towards the wall. We know that statins are not healing people. We need to remove inflammation from the diet, get rid of the omega-6 fatty acids, especially the vegetable seed oils, reduce our refined carbohydrate and sugar intake, and consume more high-quality, nutrient-dense animal foods. Check out my video, Why Cholesterol is Good for You, as well as Do Our Bodies Produce Enough Cholesterol to understand more about the topic in general. Thank you guys for joining me. Please like the video, subscribe, hit that bell icon. really helps me out. It's why I work so hard for you guys. Uh, if you want to support me further, check out Frankie's Free Range Meat, high-quality, nutrient-dense animal foods at an affordable price, frankiesfreerangemeat.com. I also have Frankie's Naturals, 
hygiene and cosmetic products, minimal ingredients, minimally processed. Go to frankiesnaturals.com to look like a Roman statue with bronze skin and nice white teeth. Thank you so much for joining me guys and enjoy the rest of your day.